Hi, this is Amy with Solid Fire, and I'm here with Matt. Matt, can you introduce yourself? Hi, I'm Matt Stevenson. I'm a senior software engineer at CloudBees. Excellent. So we were just talking a little bit about the evolution of OpenStack, and you had some really interesting perspectives on that. Can you tell us a little bit more? Yeah, um, back in 2012, I contributed to the uh, Nova project, and um, so I came to the summit back then, and it was uh, much more, uh, it was a much less mature community at the time, and the distributions and the APIs have a lot more maturity now. It's a lot easier to integrate with things in a way that is uh, reliable to in, in, uh, in various deployment environments. So what is, if you had to pick one or two that you have found most interesting and that you're hearing a lot of feedback around and that you personally as a technologist are interested in, what would you point people to and to learn more about? Um, I've, I've actually had a little bit of interest this summit on the uh, Manila project. It seems pretty cool. Um, Cinder's coming along, has come along really nicely. Um, and of course, all of the regular OpenStack projects, open source projects have, have matured in their own ways. So. I contributed back to back in the day to Nova, and it, I, it looks great these days. So, so what would you say to anybody who's not able to attend? Um, any pointers or thoughts for the people watching us outside these four walls? Uh, something to look for in particular? Uh, join the mailing list, contribute, and uh, take a look at uh, how the projects have kind of developed over the last few years. And um, you know, it's it's a lot more consumable than it was um, years ago. And so this year, it seems like a much more mature overall environment. So I would I would give it a, a big thumbs up for being a solid re, um, redeployable system. So. Do you think that that has changed the people who are attending or feel like they can? Do, do you think people felt like they had to be a certain type of technologist before and that's changed? Yeah, I think that actually OpenStack's a lot more um, accessible to people now. Um, it used to be more of the people who would show up or people who are we're all Python developers that are all kind of sitting in a room together, going on about the same thing over and over again. And um, now I'm hearing a lot more higher level abstraction work. There's a, a lot of the projects are easier to get into because the tests are a lot better. So um, it's not just nitty gritty Python development these days. Very cool, it's a great perspective. So uh, our last question, since we're in Austin here for this OpenStack, food out of a truck, are you for or against this? Food trucks are great. I love food trucks, um, but I think that I like uh, I like beer too much to go all the time to the food trucks. Uh, you know, I like hanging out at the Flying Saucer and the Ginger Man and places like that where I can enjoy some of the local brews here. That's an excellent point. There's something for everybody. Yeah. <laughs> Very true. Thank you so much, Matt. Thank you. And we'll see you next time on Pop-Up Tech Talks.